It's about uh, how to learn biochemistry smartly for INIZ. One, genetics, especially the purines and the pyrimidines and the disorders associated with the purine and the pyrimidine. Then comes the different types of, in the genetics, different types of RNA where micro RNAs is very commonly asked. Then different types of uh, epigenetics where uh, DNA methylation. Then comes the telomerase, very trending topic. And uh, then epigenetics in that I've already discussed. Then Techniques. In the techniques, almost every techniques, what is it used for is compulsory you should be knowing. So all the techniques and including the recent techniques like the digital droplet PCR, liquid biopsy, etc. Then metabolism. In the metabolism, 99% of the question is coming from metabolic disorders. So rather than going into the pathways and all, what we have to learn is the metabolic disorders and the storage disorder in every carbohydrates, lipids and amino acid metabolism. Then comes vitamins, very very important topic. Every exam, it's must, uh, it's a must learn topic. So don't miss it. Each and every word in vitamins and minerals and nutrition part, the specific dynamic action, respiratory quotient, etc., calculation, etc., is usually asked. Energy content also, it's asked. Then comes the conceptual topic. In the conceptual topic, metabolic fuel and the fed and the fasting stages. Then lastly. The general enzymology part. In the general enzymology for, for part, in the INIS, the trending topics is the enzyme kinetics and the enzyme inhibition. Very important, you should be learning that. So now onwards, what I am trying is to upload a video on short videos on the PYQs daily so that we can prepare for INIS together. Thank you.